Today we're going to talk about something. And this something has to do with these list, lists of words. So I'm going to pick one of the rows of words here. Let's pick form. So form, former, formed. Hmm. I'm going to listen, read that again and listen closely. Form, former, formed. Is there anything that those three words have in common? Well, yes. I could write down in my notebook what they have in common. They all have the word form in them. Now, what is different about each word? Well, the second word has ER at the end, and this third word has ED at the end. They're all different words. They all have different meanings, but they have something in common, but they also have something that's different. Form, former, formed. Now, this part here that I've added in green is called a suffix. A suffix is a few letters that you can add onto another word to change its meaning. So let's look through another example. Let's see, um, music, musical, musician. Well, I see that they all have something in common. It's the word music. I love music. Now, I could add on, as you see, the letters A, L, and then I could, I'm then referring to an adjective. That's a musical sound that you made. Or I could be describing theater, like musical theater. Or it could be even a different noun, like a musical, which is a theatrical performance with singing. Then I also have my third word, musician. That suffix is I-A-N. So I go from talking about uh, music, I add the letters I-A-N, and then I'm adding, just talking about a person that creates music. So this is a suffix.